Hola and welcome. I haven't done a flick through chill out time for a while now and I'm due more since I've got quite a few interesting book and magazines to flick through. I'm just back from the town center right now after treating myself to a couple of retro bookazines. Well, which are hybrid of magazines and books, of course. <laughs> and uh, what better than to spend a cold, dark evening inside nice and cozy with warm tea and reminiscing with you all. So let's begin. Right now, this one caught my eye. And you can probably tell why, you know, it's got all these colors and all the retro stuff, which I absolutely love. <laughs> and, uh, you know, anything that makes me feel nostalgic, anything from the 80s, 90s, even 70s. So it's kind of like, it this caught my eye, and what caught my eye next to this was this one. Which is like, you know, 164 pages of classic video games. And it's like from the old sisters and... System... Sisters. <laughs> system. <laughs> and of course you can see the Amiga there. And I'll be honest, it's the Amiga 500 there that actually caught my eye. <laughs> it's amazing how in tune you are with the stuff which you love. <laughs> anyway. So I'm going to flick through this one today. And this one, of course is going to be, you know, the treat for another chill out time because, you know, I really cannot wait to, you know, flick through both of them actually. <laughs> so a nice chill out evening after I've come back from, you know, the town and I decided to share it with all you lot. It's like I've been excited uh, about this evening. <laughs> Ever since I actually bought this earlier on, I've been like, all the time I've been thinking about, you know, going through this. Okay, so let's see what we have here. All the goodies from our childhood. Of course, for you Star Wars fans. I'm not actually that much of a Star Wars person, to be honest. I'm sorry that may disappoint you a lot. I mean, I don't hate it, but I never actually got into it, and my brother did try, I think. The, the reason was Star Wars and Star Trek. Um, I think my brothers and my dad, I think they tried a little bit too hard to get me into it and I think it's that trying too hard that kind of like made me go off it a bit <laughs> so 80s films that defined 80 films that define the 80s Let's see. which of these nice films do I remember the breakfast club I remember that but <laughs> that's excellent adventure I definitely remember that Ghostbusters of course the Shining I haven't actually seen or heard. <gasps> Batman! I like that film. Gremlins? Yes. What else was that? Please, do uh, you know what, what I'm hoping for? Short Circuit. I'm really hoping for Short Circuit to be in here because I love the... The thing, I freaking remember that. And I hated it. <laughs> to be honest, I didn't like it at all. I mean, and again, I was little and I don't think it would have... I don't think it should have been shown to me. But, you know, I didn't like it. The Goonies! <laughs> <laughs> See, I don't remember that. Okay. Please, short circuit. Back to the future, of course. I love Back to the Future. <laughs> I'm gonna see short circuit. Come on. I saw that Field of Dreams. Is that the one where the base is <gasps> Labyrinth! I love this film! Love this, love this. I've watched this so many times over. <laughs> no. This one, I think it's the one where... I remember somebody being dead, and it's being their ghost. And it's kind of like, you know, baseball or something like this. There's something like this. The, what? No short circuit, come on! Unless I've just missed it. Almost missed Labyrinth and it was right in front of my face. I remember Care Bears. A freaking song, Gummy Berry Juice. Have you, have you ever come close to kind of, any of you ever come close to doing a Rubik's Cube? Because I came pretty freaking close. And what happened is, my friend came and he just freaking, you know, messed it all up saying, Ooh, there's more of a challenge for you. Freaking plump. Probably jealous that I was doing it. <laughs> I never actually was. Of course, it's boys' toys. <laughs> I was never actually that much of a cabbage patch dolls kind of person. I'm not a fan of dolls, to be honest. <laughs> I 
angry hippos. I remember, um, I didn't have this, but I remember going into somebody's house who had one of these, but it, and it was so freaking loud, because <laughs> I always wanted to kind of play it. It was so freaking loud, it's crazy. I didn't, I mean, the, the advertisements didn't show the freaking noise. <gasps> oh my god, I remember having one of these. Oh, where did it go? I think it was left behind. I had all these discs for it as well. Oh, I used to be on this for ages. I remember this. Oh, of course. <gasps> Walkman. Personal stereo. <laughs> this is the classic one, the Sony one. Um, did I have any of these? No, I didn't. Then the one I had was too cheap to be on this list. But these <gasps> orange, those orange, yes, these. I'm gonna zoom you in. <laughs> these freaking orange <laughs> headphones. I remember those. These ones here. I think you can see them proper here more than. I remember these. And I, oh. Just freaking, they were really bad. But it's just nostalgic. <laughs> wow. My god, I love this bookazine already! <laughs> Freaking Thundercats! I never used to watch this or anything, but I used to know it because my brother used to watch cartoons like that. But the thing is, I remember playing the Amiga game. <laughs> it was really bad on the Amiga 500. But I remember playing this. And uh, I, I'll do it one nostalgia time for all time sake. <laughs> it's just, again, it's nostalgia. What the freak? Isn't this a bit racy for... I mean, okay, maybe for boys it's okay. <laughs> it's a bit suggestive for you. <laughs> okay, let's move on from that. Ooh, Muppets. I never used to watch Muppets so much as much as I used to watch Sesame Street. Or in Arabic, Alam Simsim. <laughs> you know. Yes, we had it in Arabic too. I remember the Gremlins film. That... Why in a short circuit? Oh, raccoons, and that crazy race is whatever it's called. I remember this. I used to watch this thing a lot. What was it called? I used to. <laughs> I used to have a collection of troll dolls. <gasps> little Walkman. I wanted the little Walkman. Nintendo. That's the thing, I, I remember somebody having one, and I remember playing Tetris on it, but I was never into that that much. Maybe due to exposure, but then again, I was not into the consoles as much as the computers. Uh, the only console, you know, I got close to playing, as in, well, not close to playing, the actual one I actually freaking played, was the Sega Master System. I had more exposure to that, and, um, you know, I knew that way more. Oh, these are all NES. Well, for you NES fans out there, this, um... My little pony! I had one of these. <laughs> Cozy. Dream phone. Look at the freaking size of it. <laughs> you can get away with things like dream phones like this. <laughs> Oh, speak and spell. I used to see all these things around, but I never had them myself. But I remember them. Oh, this rings a bell, kind of. You know, for some reason, this card one. I must have watched this when I was little. I remember like, some sort of memory of this. <gasps> Mouse Oh, I didn't have this, but, um... Oh, there was one similar. I hope it's in here. What's it freaking called? I never had this as it on TV, but there was another one where I didn't have it, but I went to some. I went to my friend's house and she had it. The freak? Yeah, Screwball Scramble. It, we used to have that. It was so good. I used to be on there, you know, at her house. We, we used to try and like beat each other on the time. <laughs> Danger Bounce. I remember watching this. Freaking pen. <laughs> We used to, in college, we used to have a tutor who looked just like this mall. <laughs> Freaking He-Man. Boys toys. 
two should have just proper boys. Ooh. I think this is a bit too much. If I had this, if I was little, uh, when I was little, I, it would have traumatized me for sure. It's just, it's a bit too much. <laughs> oh, this thing. I never hide it. I don't actually remember it at all. But recently I saw someone, um, you know, reminisce about it. And um, it just, it, you know, they switched it on and everything. It's just creep. Ooh, it was a bit creepy, <laughs> to be honest. Um, it's alright, you know. But, yeah, this thing. It wasn't, um, my friend didn't have this one. They had the Sega Master System too, but I remember these uh, controllers. Exactly these, and I remember playing Mickey Mouse. I think it was Castle of Illusion or something on, you know, on her computer, on her, um, what do you call it? This one, yeah. This one, that's what she had. And I remember playing that Mickey Mouse Castle of Illusion. Ooh, Game Gear! I remember my brother used to, my brother's friend used to come around with his. And of course, he used to always, you know, never used to be on batteries, he used to plug it into the outlet. And, um, it's Prince of Persia. I just instantly recognized Prince of Persia anywhere. <laughs> Doesn't matter which platform it is, I'm like, okay, that's Prince of Persia. Anyway, my brother's friend used to, um, you know, always come around with his game gear. And I used to watch him play Sonic. I think I watched him complete the first one. Sesame Street or Alam Simpson in Arabic. And um, this... <laughs> I used to always watch this. Man. Black times of freaking innocence. <laughs> Grover! <laughs> That's how he used to talk like all the time! <laughs> Sorry, that was a bad Grover expression. But I used to remember these two. I remember one was a freaking horizontal and one was a vertical head. <laughs> Bird and Ernie. But yeah, I used to. I never used to watch Muppets that much as much as these. These, I remember my brother used to watch Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles and I used to watch it with him every day before going to school. And I kind of got hooked on it because of my brother. <laughs> he used to always like, you know... Oh, pogs! I remember freaking remember these. Hold on, I'm getting to a head. Calm down. Slow down. <laughs> Super Ted and Spuddy! I used to watch these. Oh, is Thingy gonna be in there? Oh, I used to watch that a lot. Um, Mysterious Cities of Gold. Does anybody, any one of you know this? Mysterious Cities of Gold? Or in Arabic, it's um, Al Ahlam al I remember in Arabic as well. And um, yeah, I used to watch this. It was so good. It was so addictive. My brother used to be into it as well. And I remember that. Oh, I remember that. I'll cut in and play the theme song to it. I love the theme song to it. song to it. I think I, I still do to this day. <laughs> but yeah, Pugs, I remember. I never used to collect them as much as I would like to. There was like so many other things to collect, but I had a few. Not this, like this many, probably like this kind. This amount. I don't know where the freak they went. But there was like a craze going on. But there was also a craze of marbles. Those little marbles. We used to, I used to collect those. I still got the, my marbles actually, the tin. I haven't lost my marbles. Sorry, bad joke, I know. <laughs> What's this? 
I don't remember this school whatsoever. Ah, Captain Planet. I don't remember this either. I kind of do. I remember Captain Planet, but I never used to watch it. What Panini stickers? Again? <laughs> don't remember those. Hero Quest! This, I know the uh, computer game, the Amiga game, Hero Quest, and I don't even know how what the freak to play on Hero Quest. The only thing I remember about Hero Quest is the title tune. I, l I like the title tune, I always liked it. But I never understood the game, and I think it's probably because you needed to know the board game. So only recently I found out that you needed the board game. Oh, this dude! He looks familiar. He looks familiar. Is he also on the Spectrum game or something? Yeah, he is. There. <laughs> Mask. I remember the, the seeing um, adverts of this commercials. Shira. Shira. It rings a bell, but I kind of, you know. This dude rings a freaking bell. G.I. <laughs> Joe. I remember hearing that so much. Like kids in school going on about it all the time. <gasps> Music! Yeah, I got one here! <laughs> I used to be, back then, I used to be crazy in the Madonna's older stuff. Even now, I think the older stuff, I prefer Madonna's older stuff to freaking the recent stuff. I don't like the recent stuff at all. I got a lot of records. My got, still got my Madonna records. Still got my um, some of these singles actually on vinyl records. Of course, La Isla Bonita. Is it this? I used to prefer Madonna. I mean, back then, I'm not too keen on Madonna herself, but her music was good. Aha, uh -huh, of course, stick on me. These are just classics. I still listen to these. In fact, you've heard them on my channel. Ooh, running up that hill, Kid Bush. I remember. I still have that, actually. Come on. No Scrubble Scramble. No Mysterious Cities of Gold. And no freaking Short Circuit movie. Come on. Not in the hip hop. Not in the R&B. Oh, come on, three things which they didn't have. Well, let's go see if we can find short circuit. Did we just pass the films? Yeah. Come on. No, we didn't. So <laughs> we did then. Come on, we gotta we gotta search for what you call it, short circuit. The Breakfast Club, okay. Commando, Karate Kid. Yeah, I remember Karate Kid. Freaking wax on, wax off. Who doesn't? Oh, who framed Roger Rabbit? I remember that. I'm actually looking through them properly now, so I might actually notice it. Wall Street. No. Bill and Ted's. Okay, oh, I've mentioned that. I remember watching that. I really liked that. Ghostbusters, of course. Shining. Batman, of course. Um, Gremlins, of course. Some really nice movies. There was another one. Uh, I remember another movie. Um, was it Weekend at Bernie's? That's one. Um, what's it called? Brewster's Millions? I remember that. And, of course, come on. I really like um, Short Circuit. I love those. Short Circuit 1 and 2. Of course, um, thingy as well. What you call it? Beverly Hills Cup that tune. Axel F. <laughs> the Goonies. Police Academy. Back to the Future, of course. Oh, take my breath away. Thingy. Top Gun. With um, films and movies, if I. I'm not that great with the names. 
I will know the film itself rather than, sorry, the film like in viewing it itself rather than its name. Oh, Flash Gordon! It's a freaking big, huge thing here. I remember watching this. <laughs> I did this with Labyrinth. It's like it's so it's like so big, plain inside, and you're missing it. <laughs> I remember watching this on TV when um, we bought a new after we bought a new couch halfway through the film. Uh, they bought a new couch, so. You know, they swept the couch and then we continued freaking watching it on the new couch. It was kind of cool. I remember that film for this. Poltergeist. Yes. That I remember. So, come on. Never ending story, of course. <laughs> Labyrinth. This is just my... As I said, it was my, ha my happy film. Come on. Come on. Short Circuit. Short Circuit. And Short Circuit 2. At least one of them put it in. I remember the ad for Micro Machines. I had one. I had one freaking Micro Machine. <laughs> it was like a small white car. I used to find it cute. I never, obviously, I never like, you know, wanted to get more or anything, but my brothers had a few. I found, I found, I found the little cars cute. And of course, who does not remember E.T.? <laughs> Okay, so that's all for today. I hope you enjoyed the flick through and uh, share these wonderful memories uh, with me. <laughs> you know, well, I'm, it's like a lot of things. I'm glad I got this book. It's like a lot of things which um, I had forgotten about. I just kind of remembered and it kind of like um, brought up other memories as well. So if there's like other things which you saw in the book that made you feel nostalgic, do share them in the comments below. Thanks so much for the likes, the shares. Do leave your thoughts in the comments below. Don't forget to check out my other videos and do subscribe for more. I will leave you with these nice warm fuzzy memories and of course, say adios! <laughs>